grew up on a farm. And I started kind of being introduced to farm a little bit with in high school. Um, took four years of agriculture and did FFA and really enjoyed what I was doing with all of that. I'm a farm manager for U.S. Bank and that's currently what I do to this day and is to help manage farms and also support U.S. Bank farm management as a whole. The farming background is historically male dominant and you're starting to see more and more females in the agricultural field. There is a little bit of that pressure of dealing with a woman. Um, some of the tenants have flat said stuff about dealing with women, but you just kind of brush it off and you go on and you do what you know to do and how you know to do it. Working with women, like in our learning circles and stuff that we're doing, women are more comfortable talking to women. So women who may have owned land or, you know, husbands have passed away and now they're responsible for that land, they go to guys and they back down. They become timid because it's guys coming at them with, well, this is what I'm going to do. Maybe they've been on the farm, but they don't have all the hands-on knowledge that their husband had. So as another lady, I can talk to them and even say, you know, they can be more comfortable talking to me to say, okay, I have a farm, here's what it is, here's what I'm running into. And then I can discuss with them, okay, you know, your cash rent for your land, sh you know, should be this amount. You're not getting a fare, or yes, you're getting something fair, or um, maybe they don't want to have to deal with it anymore. Well, they can come to me and talk to me and I can help them. You know, I can manage that farm for them. I can give them that net income. I can deal with that tenant that maybe they're having difficulties with, or, you know, they say, hey, I don't think the tenant's taking care of my land, but as a person of the community, I don't want to be responsible for saying, hey, I really need to go with somebody else. You know, any aspect of farming that they're not comfortable with, they can then come to us and say, you know, can you help me? So as a female farmer or a person that has inherited their land, either from generations that have come in the past, um, I would tell you that make sure that you are prideful of what you have and what you have gathered and what has come from generations. Don't be afraid of the man that stands up in front of you. You have a piece of property that's been in your generations for years and you're proud of it. So take pride and enjoy it.